properties of soil now let us know about the moisture in the soil by performing an activity take a boiling tube put 2 spoons of soil sample in it heat it on a flame and observe it we can find the water drops on the inner walls of the upper side of the tube the reason behind this is on heating water in the soil evaporates moves up and condenses on the inner walls of the upper part of the boiling tube after heating the soil take it out of the tube compare it with the soil which has not been heated we can observe that the moisture is less in the soil which is heated in the summer holidays let us visit farmland during day we can find the air above the land shimmering or shining the reason is on a hot summer day the vapor coming out of the soil reflects the sunlight and the air above the soil seems to shimmer now let us discuss about absorption of water by soil let us find out whether all the soils absorb water to the same extent by performing an activity take a plastic funnel and a filter paper fold it in the shape of a cone and place it in a funnel as an inverted cone weigh 50 grams of dry powdered soil and pour it into the funnel measure a certain amount of water in a measuring cylinder and pour it drop by drop on the soil by using a dropper pour water all over the soil keep pouring water till it starts dripping subtract the amount of water left in the measuring cylinder from the amount you started with this is the amount of water retained by the soil now let us calculate the percentage of water absorbed by the soil by using the formula displayed on the screen in the formula w is the weight of the soil in grams which is 50 grams u is the initial volume of water in the measuring cylinder v is the final volume of water in the measuring cylinder repeat the activity with other different soil samples and analyze the results